Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the farm. Now, December. It's a chilly day. So, what I'm going to be doing today, though, is I'm going to be clearing more trees for the farm so we can get more crops planted come springtime. I'm going to do it on this side of the road, just over there past the trees. So, let's come over here and get the Kubota out. Yeah, I'll go ahead and cut those trees down, and I'll probably. Go ahead and uh, uh, plow that up as well. I'm trying to decide as well where I want to put greenhouses. Not sure about that yet. I don't know if I want to just take up some space over here and put them down. Or what I'm also thinking is cutting down some trees on this side of the barn so I can have room to put that stuff there but I'll cross that bridge when I get there right now I just want to focus on getting an area cut for a more another field but thankfully though with the Kubota it should be pretty light work Yeah, let's leave a few trees right here. I like having those trees sitting there. I think what we'll do is come down to maybe about, oh golly, right here. This tree right here that I marked. I'm just go in a straightish line. go like that. Oh. <laughs> there we go. I'll probably though get rid of these bushes right here that are in between. I will be sitting in between the uh, field in my house. Probably get rid of those just I think it looks nicer. Man, that's a big tree. Um, I think that's good right there. Start going this way. I want to leave a tree line between me and this other one right here. Post to snow tonight, so should have a white Christmas. <laughs> uh, I was hoping there would be snow on the ground for today's episode, but uh, it didn't happen. But what can you do about it? Not much. Keep on keeping on. I can do it's 
on you. All right, guys. So I got a pretty decent sized spot cleared out. Let's go ahead and park the Kubota now. And let's go get hooked up to the plow. Now let's go ahead and walk over there. I've been sitting all day working, so let's use my legs. God gave us legs for a reason, might as well use them. <laughs> yeah, let's go ahead and... Oh man, it's going to be a cold one though. It's cold outside and this tractor doesn't have cab on. I'm going to have to pull out the semi. So it's going to start in this cold weather. Oh yeah. Like it's 90 degrees outside. Nice semi truck. Hopefully that's good enough. Oh, well the tractor start. Oops, wrong button. Uh-oh. Come on, one more time. Let's go. There we go. Like I said, you know, it's pretty cold outside, so... Well, let's go ahead and open this door. Close that one. I need to get myself a power washer for the farm as well. I'll try and buy one by the end of the day. No, not sure where to put it. I think if I put it maybe right here. Yeah, let's see if I can do that right now. There we go. Got a power washer. Very nice. Some of these trees still got leaves on them. Figured they'd all be missing leaves with it being December, but I guess not. Man, that is a nice looking farm. I like that. Need to get rid of that bush right there. Let me do that real quick. It'll be easy peasy. Boom. There we go. I like that. See, I didn't make too large of an area. Because I don't want to go too big this early on. Because I want to try to avoid taking out a loan. So I think I'll start off with smaller equipment. At least that's the plan. That's not how it usually goes for me, though. Rusty red on her shoulder I was cleaning her shoe When it clicked on the trot over In the bright We brushed and we braided dandelions and chewed It was a mutual arrangement we both saw into But can she walk in the fire? Can she run in the rain? Can she make it up the mountainside? make it down again I have often wondered if she'll go and jump the fence Will she keep on moving onward or stay in what could have been Broke my arm in December We were running for the thrill you turned in the canyon to the snowbank where I fell Even still I remember 
star on the forehead that was easy to find when I let down her bridal the saw into her hazel eyes we had a deep understanding never had to use a bit was a mutual arrangement and an honest respect Can she walk in the fire? Can she run in the rain? Can she make it up the mountainside? Can she make it down again? I have often wondered if she'll go in beyond the fence Will she keep on moving onward or stay in what could have been? Will she keep on moving onward or stay in what could have been? Alright guys, so I'm making the last pass. At least, I believe it'll be the last pass. I'm pretty sure this is big enough. Yep. Here we go. Oh, nope, it wasn't. <laughs> Golly, I messed it up. Now we're done. <laughs> All right, so pretty decent size spot. Um, yeah, I thought about making the field bigger, but like I said at this earlier in the video, I'm probably gonna start off with smaller equipment because I don't want to have to take out a loan, so I don't have to spend a bunch of money on equipment. Um, this will probably be the last bit of significant trees I clear for a while. I would like to clear some more. Probably this spot right here in front of me. Probably clear some more out of there at some point. Um, or so I can put an animal pen. I'm thinking I'll probably get sheep. Because uh, those are, they're making some good money with their wool and they're not, they don't cost a lot of money to take care of. You just need water and uh, hay bales. Um, so that's probably what animals I'll get. I would like cows at some point, but for now we're just going to go with sheep. Let's go ahead and get this sprayed off and put away. And I think before I end the video, I'll zoom out and do a before and after We'll look at what this area used to look like and what it looks like now. Kind of like a year end review since it's December. If I remember to, I'll try and do that next year as well at the end of the year. I think that'd be a cool thing to do at each year. Just show, okay, this is what it looks like. At the, this is what the farm area looked like at the start of the year. And this is what it looks like now at the end of the year. So I'll go ahead and get this tractor put away. And then we'll take a look at how things have changed around here. Alright guys, so this is what the farm looked like at the start of the series. Obviously there is nothing there. Just a bunch of trees. Now, let's take a look at what it looks like now. And here is what the farm looks like now. Obviously, a lot has changed. Yeah, this is really cool. I'm really glad I decided to play on this map. I like the way things are turning out on here. Nice field here and here. Farm. Very beautiful farm. And then, yeah, I believe what I will do is this area right here behind the red barn I will probably put greenhouses there. And then I'm thinking right there in that area I'll cut down some trees and put a sheep pen there. So yeah, go ahead and take it off flying mode. Yeah, that'll be it for today. Thank you guys very much. And by the time this video releases, it'll be Christmas Eve. So yeah, I wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Uh, not sure if I'll have a video out, by New Year's, so in case I don't, I'll wish you guys a Happy New Year as well. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. I can't wait to see you all again very soon. Bye.